so hey guys, we are going to be editing, I'm going to show you how I edit photos. So right now I'm going to show you what, um, how I edit photos. So let me actually make this picture bigger. If you don't know who this is, this is my dog Delilah. Isn't she so cute actually? She's so, so, so cute. Oh, look at little, look at little tongue. This is when she was a puppy, now she's a big dog, like a big dog. Okay, so you see this face, well... I'm using GIMP right now, if you don't know. Uh, I like to zoom in a lot. So, I kind of want to take this and kind of lighten this side up. So, I'm going to go to this. I'm going to go do some soft lighting. I'm going to go to this opacity. I'm going to go to this size. Not that big of a size, but this size. And I'm going to just kind of lighten a yeah, maybe bigger opacity. I'm just going to lighten it. So that was on airbrush too, so you really have to be on this. That, that's what I use the most. Don't worry about that. So we're, we're you know, we're doing this, but I, I don't really like how her ears are really looking. I mean, nothing's really wrong with it, except she's got a little bit of darkness to her face. So we're just gonna go to overlay, opacity, and just I kind of want to darken her face up a little bit. Let me just see how this works. Really, it's a trial and error thing when you're editing photos. Really, I just don't really like how she her fur is kind of looking overexposed a little bit to me. To me, at least. I mean, she might not. I mean, I kind of want to get it as real as I could. I remember this picture actually. Okay, now. We kind of want to clean this up, so we're going to turn the opacity way down. And we're going to make this a dissolve. We're going to... Actually, I don't think this is working at all. I don't know what I'm trying to do now with this. So we are going to darken only. We're going to try... Actually, I think I need to go in and do this. Okay, go to around 200. Oh, this is really close up. So we're going to... My freaking camera keeps on... Not my camera. Did I have to say my camera? Yes, my camera. We're going to go into the healing tool. That's what we actually need to do. Healing tool. I love this healing tool. Okay. recommend now making sure that these um because these are really <laughs> some big shadows so we're actually going to line only these are some really tough shadows and that is really bad huh? don't choose line only that's terrible <laughs> 
Let's just do a soft light. Okay, that looks a little bit better. Looks great, doesn't it? Looks absolutely freaking fantastic. Okay, let's. Okay. Now let's look at it from afar. Yeah, her fur looks a whole lot softer and it looks a whole lot better. Don't you just want to cuddle Delilah? Don't you just want to cuddle her? So now what I would do in this part is I would um if I can find it. Oh yeah, crop right here. I would crop out any sort of other unnecessary things. So that it gives you more foreground instead of a background. Even the background is actually one of the most important things you can do. Now, if you really want to be special, which you don't have to do this, but I sometimes like to do this, is a lighting effect. Because the sun basically was right here. Let's look at her fur. I think it was around right here. Let's see how this actually works. Probably just gonna mess it up. But, you know, it's good. No, I don't really like that. Not at all, actually. So, this is how you would edit. This is how I would normally edit. It's like something like this. But, you know, you can do whatever you want. I'm gonna come back with another picture that I would love to, that I've edited, and it's been on my, um, it's on my deviant art so let's go check it out okay guys oh we're really back okay so if you want to know what the software i'm using to record this screening it's the open broadcaster software okay so this is a picture of leah one of my friends from belarus she's over here for the for five more weeks six four more weeks oh god that's too quick no don't oh crap okay what what is this how am i zooming in but i actually need to zoom in so with this photo i definitely want to do something i want to go in and add a lighting and shadow and a lighting effect because the sun was over here Let's see if this works. If not, we can do some editing to it. Okay, that looks really nice, actually. Yeah, that's nice. So, we're gonna go in, and the first thing that I want to do is I want to get rid of this. I want to, I want to do something with this. Like, that's the first thing I want to do. I want to change the way that her face looks. So, not like drastically like that, no. More like, I want to, go in and more or less more or less really just go in and actually the first thing that I did not even realize I could do go to 400 grab the pencil turn down the opacity Turn down the size. And just go on it. No, not that. So let's look how, let's see how this looks. Mm, no. It'd be better if we turned down the opacity. Just go in and fix those eyes. Yeah, that 
looks really nice. So with her face, we really, I think it's better if we go in and do, I mean, it's just something, shoot, what the heck? That was different, oh my. Overlay. The first thing I want to do is I want to go ahead and fix this dress. And then I want to go in, this is really how you do a makeover. So the picture was downloaded from the internet, so really. It's not gonna be the best, not gonna be the best quality in the world, but it's better than nothing. So we are going to go in and we are going to turn down the size even more still. Opacity. Actually we're gonna turn up the opacity. Turn up you guys. So we're gonna go in and we're Actually I see a lot of people doing this. So go ahead and go to new layer. Layer. So this layer is going to be our hair. Okay. Go in, let's darken it up a little bit. how I changed it that much. Okay, that... No, I, I still don't like it that much. Okay, so we're gonna go in just do... It's better if you actually do it a tinier. What the heck? I don't want that. So now what I want to do is I want to actually go in, go to hard light, get the opacity like that, and I want to kind of, I'm going to go in and make it look like I have been doing this all day. Okay, hard light's not that good, so we're going to do an overlay. We're doing that to the layer, no wonder. Oak. Did I just say oak? Oak. Let's go to soft light instead. I didn't realize what I was doing. So here we are, and we, oh, not that much. We want to darken the I'm really beginning to like this. So I'm going to go in. So the thing that you want to do right here is zoom in. You're gonna you want to zoom in and you want to basically go in, find it was a dark blue, I remember this. It's kinda like this. You kinda wanna go in and turn down the size a lot. Okay, that's great. So, really, let's go to overlay, let's turn up the opacity, just kind of go through and, you know, do this, just, you know, add some, you know, it was, this is more of our color, okay. more of just 
do some spinning around and stuff. And let's see if that made a bit of that. It actually made a little bit of a difference, actually. I think I really want to do is I want to go in and change that. This is more of her color. So we're going to turn this up. Let's add a new layer. So, we want to add some color. And let's just do layer 11 then. So go in and just do some stuff like this. Yep, that brings some color back to her face. But maybe you just want to do something like this on her arm. Make it look like she's like an actual human, I guess. How does this look from this angle? Looks a lot better, actually. It looks really good. So now I want to do, I want to go in again and make the grass. So can I just add another layer? Okay, just, yeah, we'll just do this. So, okay, now we are going to go in and we are going to turn this back, go through here, find a nice green. Sim, 
and um, that's really how I edit my photos, you guys. So um, I hope you guys enjoy it, and I really did actually enjoy it. So there's more things that you can know you can go in. I can go to artistic, you know. I can add some, you know. I can do anything I really want to. But what I really, I'm really, I'm going to be doing a lot of these because I do do. I love editing photos. That is something I love to do. So I will show you guys me editing the photos. So I hope you guys enjoy this. As always, leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And I will talk to you guys in the next video. Bye.